uh, Budapest, the city where you can walk home at six in the morning with no issues, apparently. Y'all, we have fun. We have fun tonight, baby. Free drinks, dancing, like, oh my. <laughs> Tonight was a night, and then tonight is the bathhouse night. Like, what the? It is six in the morning. I was not even gonna go out looking a little crazy. I got on my long pants and my long sleeve because you know I put it in my bag just so I could be ready. I could take a boat on Metro, but honestly, it's so early in the morning, you may as well get the walk in. Pretty safe. Some people are about to fight on the side of the street, but hey, that's their business. Anyways. Yeah, I'm about to go shower and nap. I'll see y'all. It was so fun. Oh my gosh. So many people were vibing with the energy. I'm so flattered. I'm so... I had a couple people hit me up and they're just like, yo, like... I had one girl. She's like, I just love your energy. I was like, oh, okay, okay. But anyways, yeah. It was a good night overall. No complaints. Wig looking crazy. I need to fix this up. And... Yeah, but that's all. I will see y'all later. Damn, it was so fun. They were showing your girl love today. They were showing your girl love. I had a cute fit on, but it's underneath the street fit, so. Whew. Up like three and a half hours later after I went to sleep is sick, but because of the time difference, the morning is beneficial for me right now. I drink way too much, y'all. I don't know what happened. I drank way too much. Oh my gosh. I'm so disappointed with myself. Because I still got a party tonight. I got a boat party, all you can drink, and then I got a spa party. So let me be careful and not do anything too wild or crazy before I leave Budapest. But damn, I'm going to Prague. I met somebody from Prague. And he said they party even harder than Budapest. I was like, well, I'm only staying two days there, which is probably for the better. Because I heard Prague is a party city, but I'm in no rush to find out. I'm good. Anyways, I'm trying to chug water. I need a nap. I'll probably end up taking a nap right before I leave again. But oh my fuck. Bro. <laughs> Even the wig is down atrocious right now, y'all. Like, oh my fuck. The wig says it all. It's not even fully on my head. The wig says it all. Yo, you're up. Give you gassing your girl up too much. Too much. Everybody's like, baby, you're so sexy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I be wearing that skirt with a slit. I be wearing a little bandeau like this. I don't care if my titties are sagging. I don't give a fuck. Not one. Y'all gonna see what I have to show and what I want to show. Anyways, everybody's just, you're so sad. I had people pulling me and they're like, listen, you are beautiful. Oh my gosh. I had this girl. She came up to me. She's like, when you came in the room, me and my boyfriend, like, wow, 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 wow. It's the security. It's the openness. It's the being able to give a compliment without being weird. It's the genuine energy. I went in the bathroom. Mighty fine girl. Mighty fine motherfucking girl. Y'all, thick in the leggings, everything. Like, I went in. She was like, ooh. Like, she said something in her language. But it, she the way she was gesticulating it sounded good and like she like pointed to her friend like girl look like i was like no look at y'all like hold on wait wait, wait, wait. <laughs> you do to me like oh man imagine if i really actually took care of myself like worked out ate better but honestly europe's been good to me europe's been good to me i was literally just watching a video about one how a lot of americans when they come to europe i don't know i'm not fixing the way y'all gonna have to stare at me like <laughs> a lot of americans will go out of not even europe but the country and it's the lack of gunshots it was a video this girl was partying there was a loud pop and she started screaming and it was confetti but she thought it was a pow pow you know and then there was another video and it was basically saying that between the pedestrian friendly lifestyle and the good food which i've known for years and you know just whatever you eat and how you live and quality of life that you can actually end up losing weight in some of these countries the ingredients and the food so yeah i'm really enjoying it i know my mom moved to the states but i'm gonna secure that passport but i've been mentioning it to people they get so excited they're like yo grab that grab that you need that passport that's 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 the gold mine i'm like yeah and it's so funny because like my mom moved to america but then it's like girl i'm trying to go back <laughs> so yeah let me fix my hair but no dead ass like it's been so it's been so good y'all my energy was stuff. i was and i told somebody off yesterday and I hope I wasn't being too harsh, but basically somebody wanted to come bulldoze in my life. 
And it's like, bro, I'm not, nobody's trying to marry your ass. Nobody's trying to do all, don't even start. But they came in my life acting like a vibe, talking about spirituality and this, that, and the third, and blah, 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 blah. And then it's like, bro, what is with this generation and ghosting? It is so dumb. Just communicate. You don't understand how hurtful that is to people. And I was basically triggered because I was like, bro, people keep coming into my life. They love the energy. They love the vibe. And then either they find something about me that's too much to handle, whatever it might be. I'm not trying to make myself seem perfect, I promise. But yeah, like people will come in and they just won't be able to maintain the vibe they pretended to have in the first place. Or they want something at the end of the day or they're like everybody else. And it was irritating me because I was like, I, I basically let them know. I go, hey, listen, like I know you're going through a lot, but please understand that other people are also going through a lot. That word sonder where everybody's living their own life.